I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Got a few rare yew weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows. Wind wisps, too. No oh, matter yeah, what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Notice he didn't say price. that you seem staunchly determined to master your broadcasting. Hi, cool. Extra spell. Uh, now let's go back and get in trouble. How nice to see you, my young friend. Tasks I've given you, and then meet me in my classroom to learn Defindo, the severing charm. It's typically used to cut an object, but can be a powerful weapon when needed. I just. Okay, yeah, we're Sebastian. just fucking stocking up on spells right now. It has. Fuck, I did it again! Blast, Blast out first. God damn let it. me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took God the fall for me, and that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment, in the Undercroft. Not even the professors know about this place. There's a secret passage just here. How did you find this place? My friend, Ominous Gaunt. He named it the Undercroft. We used to play gobstones here all the time. With my sister, Anne. She loved that infernal game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. So please, keep this between us. He never confides in anyone. But he's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize that. We used to sneak in here almost daily. We've never been caught. I think I've seen Ominous in potions. Or was it Herbology? I've noticed that he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell could reverse it. His wand seems almost sentient. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. I've never heard anyone else speak of it, and I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one, especially I mean, he says that, but like He has no love lost for his family or their kind of shit in here. But this place is special to him. Understood. Unless they brought all this here themselves? But... Why does Ominous have no love lost for his family? His father's family are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Obsessed with blood status, most of them. I mean, Ominous cannot that just abide means that there's them. more powerful magic that's the making him blind than they have that anyway, make him unblind. The Undercroft has been I, a perfect I think that's place how Harry Potter works, yeah? Away from prying eyes, and even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Like what? Like the Blasting Curse. Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to the teach students. The blasting curse. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic. But you should learn it. I can teach it to you safely here. It may take a while to get the feel for it. Mimic my wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. Very well.
You're getting it. Yeah. Have a go at those candelabras. Both have their uses, but I think you'll find... Confringo! Nice work. How's it feel? It's a tad hot. That's it! I think I've got it. Well done. Let's make it here. Yeah, but I'm thinking like in I'm not like for and for talking about for say, the the wise blind. That. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo. There's fucking our curses eyebrows. are real weird in this. I don't exactly how they <laughs> I work. I would pay to see that. I swore we never did it down. It's just a matter of how so strong the person who puts it on is. Something about that spell that's addictive. And then knowing the proper technique or something. This is exactly the type of magic I've been hoping to learn. There's more where that came from. Been practicing similar spells here for ages. Although, I didn't tell Anne and Ominous about every one. Haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without Anne. I'm sorry about your sister. If there's anything I can do... Perhaps when I next head to Feldcroft, you could come along. Meet Anne. She could use some cheering up. Just let me know when and I'll meet you. Oh, she misses Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, you'll have to meet him too. I thought well, she was dead based on how he was talking, precisely dude. what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Cheers. By the way, what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? I'm not sure where to start. You said something was missing from what you found in the library. Might it have something to do with Victor Rookwood? He didn't mistake you for someone else at all in Hogsmeade, did he? Nothing gets past you. I'll tell you what I can. Rookwood and Ranrock are trying to recover something they think I took from a vault in Gringotts. Gringotts? When were you there? Professor Fig and I wound up there after the dragon attack. There was this port key that... A port key? To Gringotts? Well, it's all a bit convoluted. I'm listening. You must promise to keep this between us. I trusted you with knowledge of this secret undercroft. You can trust me. All right. I can see traces of ancient magic. Ancient magic? I don't know what I was expecting you to say, but it wasn't that. What does that even mean? Honestly, I'm not entirely certain. All I know is that I can see whispers of an old magic that hardly anyone else can. Fig and I think that Ranrock has somehow found a way to harness that magic's power. Are you telling me that goblins may be wielding some sort of wizard magic? That's what we're trying to find out. And this ability of yours, does this allow you to wield this magic too? I... Uh, yes. I don't know. I have been well, fucking deleting know, things with this tell me. With ability, so I've yes. I've been studying archaic forms of magic for ages. Perhaps we can help each other. In the meantime, You're also with both Rookwood and like Ranrock 16. after you... I suspect a bit more time practicing the blasting Ages means like a year order. and a half for you. Spend as much time here as you'd like. And remember, keep this place between us. When I head to Feldcroft, I'll send you an owl. It seems... Uh... Hmm. Possible. Hello, Sebastian. Wait. You there? I can hear you. Oh, hello. Ominous, isn't it? I believe we have potions together. And herbology? I recognize that voice. Heard you talking to Gareth Weasley in potions class. You're the new fifth year. Did you just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? I don't remember. Was I supposed to tell this guy that I knew about this place or not? I already forgot what I just agreed to. I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. So please, keep this between us. Do you remember? I, I was not... I forgot about that entirely. Um. And remember, keep this place between us. Oh well. Sorry, Sebastian. Five minutes later. Mm.
some time later. That room's called the Undercroft. Ah, well, I was exploring and then suddenly found myself in a strange passageway. Don't lie to me. No one stumbles upon that room. Sebastian told you, well, didn't he? That took all of two you seconds. A word about this place to anyone. And not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. My father is friends with the headmaster. I am not afraid to exploit that connection if I need to. Trust me, Ominous. I won't say a well, word. Well, it's a good thing I was Sebastian able to tell him. Sebastian is a good him. friend. You shouldn't immediately it's a good thing I was able to lie if it didn't matter. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. Ominous, I just meant... I know what you meant. Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. He doesn't need your help. Sebastian is going to get an earful about this. Sounds like it. I gotta find a bunch more spells. This fucking dude just wants me to do all the drugs. Pretty much, right? Sell shit. Uh, also, I have to go get told how much a fucking broom is so I can be. so I can take out a car payment as a 16 year old in the wizarding world. Ah, oh, new face. Wonderful. Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. I had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned, thankfully with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Got a few rare yew weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows, wind wisps too. No oh, matter yeah, what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Notice he didn't say price. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. What are we looking for today? 600. Okay. I can get 600 off selling the ship. Well, I just spent a thousand gold for this previous quest to get a spell, so a little bit, yeah. And I don't even know what this is yet, so. Apparently, it's a downgrade. Thanks for stopping by. Whatever it is, is apparently a downgrade. That item is of the highest quality. All right, not that one. I kind of like that one. That item is of the highest quality. That one's not that bad either. More of no. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Thanks for stopping by. I, whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancement. Oh, Jesus. Go on. Ha! Knew I was right about you. I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct a broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Reyes, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? Sure. That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. 
The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Reyes will sort you out. Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. 